seven of um, Subway Radio Special Lounge. Ah, oh. um, so it's about time that we talked Tetris, isn't it? So, you know, we're nearly 50 episodes in and we've done a few puzzly, puzzly things, but we haven't done an official Tetris show. And that's what we're doing tonight. Kind of. So we've got five, count them, five Tetris games with the word Tetris. Official. Mm-hmm. Um, over a series of consoles. And then we're going to play games that are Tetris-like as well. So, yes, breaking against tradition, we're not doing them in console order. Break my brain when I'm editing, but there we go. It'll do. It'll be fine. Uh, right, so. The little boxes are calling. So let's go over there. There, there. Hello. And we don't need the, the collector vision because the collector vision's not featuring tonight. Boop. It's gone. Okay, so. I feel we should probably start with... Not necessarily the first one ever, but the first one everybody will have played. Arguably the reason that the Game Boy, the original OG Game Boy, sold so many copies. Um, because it was packaged with the Game Boy. So, let's get you a screen. And, yeah, we won't play it very long, we all know. We all know what uh, what Tetris on the Game Boy looks like, but we'll. Uh, I feel we have to play it, don't you? Yes. Uh, so there we go. The good old familiar, super colourful screen. It's slightly big. There we go. Uh, okay, let's let's get that familiar music going. Oh yeah, could be the Game Boy Color version. This looking at that. Ooh. And let's see if we can give ourselves the Tetris effect tonight. You know, you know when you've been playing it too long and then you see see shapes where things in real life can fit together and you go, oh my god, I've been playing it too much. And obviously there's, there, there were similar things to this beforehand, but this is kind of the granddaddy of all puzzle matching, um, puzzle pattern matching, colours, shapes. Things match them, make them disappear. The more you disappear at once, the more you points you get. I'm not going to be able to get a Tetris now, am I? Because I've fucked that up. don't expect there was any system. I mean, we're playing a lot of different systems tonight. Um, I think Tetris, obviously after Tetris was invented, but I think Tetris was um, on every single system. like uh, Nutty Cluster in the chat is already trying to backseat drive which is always nice see let's get rid of that and then we can start working towards the Tetris again can't we 
Except now it's speeded up a little bit. So. Not sure anyway. I'm playing it on on the actual screen um, that I'm watching, but I can also, in the corner of my eye, see the screen that you're seeing. And I keep thinking, oh, I've got a straight one. And oh no, no, I'm playing the straight one at the moment. Okay, so there we go. <gasps> Oh dear, it's always nice to have your backseat driving. I don't know anyone that doesn't like it. See, another Tetris straight away. So. Obviously the problem with um, Tetris. In some ways it's similar to the games we were playing last week. In that, other than the fact that it's hyper addictive. Um, you do the same thing and you just play for ages and ages We're only on level two. We'll get. Oh, good, there's a nice straight one coming along any minute now. We should probably set ourselves some sort of timer for when we play this. Because um, we can't spend the whole episode just playing Tetris. We have other things to investigate. Level six. You're optimistic, aren't you? Is that super hard? And you just um... oh no. Is it getting um, more annoying with its? Or is it just me? I did, I did play this a lot in um, on a Game Boy actually. I wonder if it's my Game Boy. I can't remember. Um. Anyway, uh, it's. Um, something that I did play in black and white um, I'm just trying to remember I wonder if it was my sister's because I was more of a Sega person I don't uh, although I suppose by that time
few of them. Fuck this now event. Do you mean haven't? Is that what you're saying? You fucked it, haven't you? No, nothing is irretrievable. by one until I get to uh, the gaps although we soon be at level six and then we'll call it a day for the original te uh, Tetris there we go we're on level six and look I can't stop my hands are just working themselves Tetris is taking all them uh, nerve endings I'm stopping I can stop anytime I like Snowy Cluster. Definitely little Russian dancers. Um, I think they either dance at the end, like the endy end, or the dance when you get to 100. Oh, so that was the original Game Boy Tetris. And now, oh, I see, see, there's definitely Russian dancers in the game. Um, I just can't remember where they are. There's a space shuttle as well. That, uh, for some reason, the space shuttle takes off when you get a certain. When you beat something, I just can't remember what it is. Um, there you go then. Let's move to well, let's move straight to the Game Boy Advance, shall we? Uh, right, the Game Boy Advanced one that we're looking at today is called Tetris Worlds. Um, we'll be coming back to the Game Boy later on for a Tetris-esque game, but for now. 
let's switch back to the big screen and give you Tetris Worlds. I hope you've all taken your mig migraine medication because um, we're going to be doing a we're going to be doing a, a virtual boy game version of Tetris in a bit. But let's play Tetris Worlds first. Should we play a two, le a two minute level challenge? We can always play another one, can't we? Oh, what? Well, we know what Tetris is. What sticky Tetris? Is that just Tetris that hasn't cleaned up? Blocks of the same colour stick together. Play the bottom row of stars to increase levels before time expires. Complete 15 levels. Shit. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I didn't see those grey ones there. Yeah, dopey mother. So, oh, so they fall through then. Oh, okay. Shit, I pressed the fall straight down button. Oh, this is mind boggling. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to manage this. How do you get them to... Do you still fill lines, I guess? We need to fill a line and find out, don't we? Right, we've got a line ready to go. We just need the right shape to fill it. another go on this aren't we well okay I think we should stick with sticky it's called sticky after all so then if uh, right oh the fucking grey ones again dickhead dick Didn't mean to drop that last one there, I don't know why it dropped. So 
if I can get rid of that, then I can drop one in. There. So I got rid of the stars. Yay. do any straight ones or do I have to drop one like that oh there Leslie uh, press the wrong one no so that's all one piece so I can't do anything with that really whereas these ones I can like do that gonna do this one am I? Oh well. At least I finished one of them. annoying when you find out that you've still got more to clear off. So I think if you're paying attention, there are ways to do this quite quick, but oh, oh, did it. No, right? Unbelievable, but true. Gonna regret doing it that way, aren't I? Oh! Stupid, stupid. Oh, I've really fucked it up now, haven't I? Oh, now I've just roofed myself. Not roofied. Somewhat flat that I can push down there. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, proper fucked it up now. That's okay, because we learned how to play Sticky Tetris. Like, sticky ribs, just not as good. Oh.
10 seconds left. Proper hoofed this time. No, I don't want to do that, do I? Oh. Oh well. Um. What? What are we looking at? What? I mean, should we have a look at another one? Or will that just really confuse us? What are the options? Oh, these are the options. What's fusion? Connect the atom blocks to the fusion block before time expires. Don't fancy that one. Clear lines on the indicators to reach the goal. Nope. Nope. Nope, I said no. No, no. We've got too many Tetrises. Tetri. Tetrinos to sort out. So that was Tetris Worlds on the Game Boy Advance. Which means we're now going to Do I risk do, do I risk saving the virtual boy for the last of our Tetrises before we move on? Because uh, we're gonna go to the game gear next, I think. Because I feel out of the ones we've got. Um it's probably the oldest after after Virtual Boy, obviously. Uh, right, let's do that then. The Game Gear. And the Game Gear is going to give us Super Tetris. I think. Looking at the screen? I don't know. It's very big, this screen. Doesn't seem at all like a Game Gear screen. Well, let's plunk it in the middle and let's have a look, see what it does. Well, that's not right, is it? <laughs> it's not playing correctly. Which means we're not playing Super Tetris. Because if I can't see the bottom, I can't play it. Oh well. It looks to me like Tetris, but with a planet behind it. So, oh, that's a shame. Um, okay. Okay. In that case then, let's pull out the big guns. Uh, let's not start it twice, because that would be bad, wouldn't it? It would also be silly. Um, we're going to go to the Saturn. Uh, came out after the Mega Drive. And it was just on the cusp of... It just missed. It tried to do 3D, but it was better suited to 2D games. Um, and if the Sony hadn't have come out with the PlayStation, which was a proper 3D game type thing, then um, it may have been different for Sega. But I had a Saturn. I like a Saturn. I, I, I've got two Saturns in a box with all the kit. Um, and some games. Some real, real games. So... Let's have a look at Tetris Plus. Whee! You should do a show and tell episode. Yeah, but... Yeah. I just get I could get a box out and show you it. And then... Oh, there you go. It's my Saturn. It's, it's a little bit like my... My... Atari VCS back here made entirely out of Lego right it's a little man in a pith helmet I mean it's very pretty okay so we won't play classic because we know classic um, so let's play puzzle mode, shall we? 
Yeah, I beat Naughty Cluster to it. Tetris with a little cartoon character. Oh, I don't care. Let's let's go to Ang 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 Call What. So I wanted to say twat then looking at that. The way it's written and everything. I feel it's an awful lot of story for my Tetris. Okay, I raised the blocks. Thought oh, it just clear clear the playing field then. Is that get clear the playing field but don't drop blocks on him? Yeah. So if you drop a right, okay, if you drop a block on him, he'll climb over it and touch the the roof sooner. So I assume we're just clearing. It won't give us anything too difficult with it being the first. Double. Ooch. 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 Oh. I don't know now. I think we might have to drop a block on him. Yeah. All oh, right, so we don't have to clear everything that's in red. Oh, that was in red on that. Okay. I know, I know. Just felt it was the best thing to do. to do that though. Oh shite. Ouch. Ouch indeed, mate. This is gonna go horribly wrong. He's gonna die horribly with sharp things in his head. I don't want that. Try that again. Let's, let's work this out this time. Come on. If I can make him climb up and over, will he will he fall down onto it? He will. So will he walk past now? Oh oh oh! Yeah. There we go. I didn't need to do all that. Then I could have just. Uh... Ouch! Ouch! Fantastic! Most of the greys, don't we? Not all of them. Just 
So if I can really fall down a little smart like there's only a little space now, but if it comes back, will that do it? It won't. Ah. So now I have to I do have to play. Come on, come on now. Get yourself across. Come on. Come on. Oh, you little shit. Come on. That's it. Go on, go on. Yeah. Ouch. Ouch, Ouch indeed. Try and do that. Let's see if we can. Um, uh, might regret doing that. Let's see. Can we get rid of. Oh! Poop! Poop! Yeah, you love some shite arc. Right, okay. He's dead. He's dead, I can't save him this time. Of course, I wasn't paying attention. Single. Single. more than a single. Dislike Tetris Plus on the Sega Saturn. Okay, cool. Oh, it's, it's nice looking. Finish, 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 end. Uh, okay, cool. Right. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. It's time to try and play Tetris in bad 3D in a weird... Um, I mean, you'd be playing it with a weird helmet on. Not a weird helmet. You'd be looking in a weird visor. That's a better way of putting it. Getting a headache and feeling sick. Um... But, again, I do have this. I do have the cartridge for this. And I do have a virtual boy, but the stand broke. And so I jury rigged my own stand for it. But yeah, it's not something you can play for very long. Okay, are you getting it all right? Yes, you are. It's a little... It's black screen. Oh! Alright. Not your Russian music. Slight level, where are we? Whoa, what's, what are the graphic types? 
Oh, it's it's fine. Look, it's fine. I'll be able to should be able to play this. It's not 3D at all. And yeah, it's called V Tetris. So where's the V? I think it's probably the star field behind it that's that's the V Ving in at you. Ships move quite fast. Um, I suppose I should have a quick uh, while we while we're looking at the same Tetris again. I should have a quick follow up on um, last week's show, where I asked for uh, anybody who might be able to point me in the direction of. Um, an adapter that I can USB uh, control uh, use use the controllers from uh, from my collector vision in USB or for emulation uh, and I found one there is there is indeed one um, it's about 30 quid so um, I think I will be will be purchasing that at some point um, it actually does Atari sticks and um, I think it does it does a whole range of stuff um, so yes yeah it does exist there is such a thing so how cool is that and no doubt when it arrives we'll um, see how well it works and we'll I'll let you know some straight ones please no rush in your own time kind regards yeah. what do you reckon that that was a 3d thing that just I don't know what it was but perhaps it was the V from Vitrus envelope of, I don't know, Gmail or something. Now, I'll be honest, the music's not as good as the Game Boy one, I don't think. Not as catchy. I'll up on saying that. I'm still moving my head to it. then um, it seems to have been playing for eight like feels like ages and yet we're only on level one so it obviously counts different from the Game Boy version Line of this sounds like like it's from Snoopy or something. Not this bit. Right, come on. We're back to the needed some straight ones. Oh 
yes, I do. Good. Right, well, we're still on level one. I wonder how, when you, how it works out when to do the next level. in a minute if it doesn't give us a straight one soon. Shit. Thank fudge for that. I need a few on the run, run though. Yay, level two. Boop, boop. Yes, I know I left a square. I was running out of options. myself anyway to put a big square on me. That means the next dress is um Probably my quota for straight ones for age. Oh, speaking too soon. again, are we? Oh. Not going to get very far with ones and twos, are we? Oh, we got to level four. When did that happen?
Wish it'd give me a bloody long straight one when I needed one. That's what she said. Right, we're back in Tetris territory now. Ah, oh, no, we're not, not yet. Now, now. When we're going to get to level six um, at this rate, because it seems to have been ages since we. There we go, level six. So um, there you go. I'm going to have to dig out my um, my Virtual Boy and see what it looks like in 3D, aren't I? See if it actually does anything in 3D. Not now, obviously, but perhaps at the weekend or something. Um, there you go. So, then, that's all the actual official Tetris that we'll be looking at. And we're going to move uh, into... G um, games that are dim, dim, Tetris flavoured. That uh, looked at Tetris and want I want a piece of that pie. Possibly. So, let's uh, crack open a few of these. Let me start. Okay, so, should we start off where we began? Back at the Game Boy. Game Boy picture appears here. Um, and let's play... Puzzle Master, shall we? I wonder how long it before before I start seeing shapes moving in my eyesight. Puzzle Master, there you go. Okay, so. Get it right. Oh, oh, actually, why am I trying to fit it to that screen? We all know it doesn't go on that screen. Oh, it goes on that screen. Look how perfectly it fits as well. Oh, dear. Right. Puzzle Master. Let's see what on earth Puzzle Master is and why I thought. Because, basically, when we had our first Puzzles um, game show, I... Um, created this one for Tetris because I thought well we've got a Tetris thing so these games are a bit like Tetris however I've not played them since so I don't actually know one assumes we match up the patterns do. Oh, that's not good. So, there is a bit of Tetrisness in it, but I personally f think this is more columnsy. Can you turn around? You can, it's that one. Okay. There's no way of me getting... I assume they're bricks and not turds. Is I, I'm not sure. I mean, how'd you get rid of the schools? Hmm. 
when they disappeared, but I'm not sure what it meant. Get rid of the skulls. I've got to be doing something wrong. This can't be it. Yeah, blue flaming turds. You are not wrong. I wonder if that gets rid. No. So I've got a little sword on the right, which appears to be filling up with stuff. I mean, is this green? Is this big blue monster? Should I be doing something there? to the row now. I mean, I can't see where there's any points either, so it's almost like there must be a quest of some description that I must be doing. Or should be doing. Why did that bounce down when I landed on it? All right, yay. So I've got a key, all right. <sighs> Boy, I'm confused. Think. Do we get the crown? Do we get the crown down on his head? Let's hope we soon find out. That's not what we do then. Oh, I thought I'd solved it then. That's annoying.
I don't know how we're supposed to get that crown. There's no way we can clear the wi the window, then we must be doing something else. Can't go any further left than we are doing. Alright. button on the left hand side. I think that's the thing I've just landed on to try. I think that's what you meant. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Should we have a go on this side? Uh, I think this is going to be our last, um, our last round of this. So, there you go. The utterly confusing with no manual um, puzzle master. Okay, okay. So, do we have any more Game Boys? No, we don't. Let's switch back to our big telly and let's do them in the order that they appear in front of me so that uh, it's just easier for me. I don't have to pick each one. Uh, so now we're going to do Baku, Baku, Animal. So, Baku, Baku. Let's have a look. This is on the Sega Master System. We don't play a lot of Sega Master System. Um, I didn't have a Master System. I went straight. Did I go straight from a ColecoVision to a Mega Drive? It was a long time ago. I think I probably went straight from a ColecoVision to a Mega Drive. Um, so. There's that. So, uh, apparently the Master System is massive. Doesn't fit on the screen very well. There you go. Oh, it's wider screened than I anticipated. Uh, so, let's have a look at uh, Baku, Baku Animal. Do we have to match up animals, do we think? I think that... <laughs> I think that music is the starting of Mr. Bob Jangles. Ah, how luck. All right, oh, well, we're off. We're off to the races straight away. Um. Okay, feed the animals. Bamboo, panda. Carrot, rabbit. Dog. Oh, here we go. My sort of level, this. Let's get that banana there so we can drop a monkey on the banana. Cut. So if we drop the dog in the middle, yes, get in there. Fancy a bone? It's not what she said. Right, okay, you have to be careful with your uh, with your joypad because, by crikey, it's sensitive. Oh no, it dropped it down itself, it wasn't me. I thought I'd done that. Let's drop a rabbit right on those three carrots, shall we? Oh, we can't link up the bones. That's disappointing. Oh! Harsh. I guess I'm playing against that green character that's um, effing me over. 
I wanted that space for my carrots. Don't know what that did. That was annoying because I needed those carrots. Don't have fruits. Could do with a panda. Oh, I won. Phew. Because it appears to be a kid's game. Can't believe I lost. Have you all got the password in case you want to play Baku Baku Animal? You all got it? Fantastic. Don't you honey me. Where's she a... Uh, girly robot? Oh, crikey, that panda ate another panda. Didn't realize it was that sort of game. Ah, oh, I should have dropped. Shite, shite. Didn't eat another panda then. Where's a rabbit when you want one? Or a monkey? Oh, just when I'm setting up a nice run of bones I get stuff dropped on me I wanted you to eat more than one bone then oh oh shite Close to winning yet. No, I'm not. I'm close to losing. Jade. Oh, that was nice. Can't drop rabbits on rabbits and get them to disappear. That's that disappointing.
Well, I'm not going to survive this round, am I? Can't see how this is going to end well at all. I could do with a quick bone. No, no, no. Stop it. Actually, I need a few bones. I need... So I'm stopping there. Look at all these freaking rabbits. It's like they're well known for something. I can't remember what. Say, I'm sure that dog just ate another dog then. These rounds go on for ages, don't they? Oh, at last. Whew. Right. We're not playing any more Baku Baku Animal. You get the gist. Wow, oh daddy. <laughs> Beat me, oh daddy. And scary metal women. Uh, there you go. Baku Baku. Uh, right, let's switch to the PSP now. I do like the PSP. Uh, and we're going to play... So, it's possible we've played one or two of these. But we're going to play Capcom Puzzle World. So there's... Oh, there you go. Can you hear it? Oh, make some noise. Um... Let's have a look. Capcom Puzzle World. Things dropping, things disappearing... Battling, I imagine. Must be time for a drinky drink. Good sign. Gems. Excuse me one second. Thank you. Oh. Oh, there we go. Don't think we need to worry about WLAN on our PSP, do you? It's going to be interesting. Oh, what have we got here now? Oh.
Let's go. Oh. That game music a little loud for you, is it all right? Ready? Yeah. Build up the colours and then drop a glowing orb on them. Like a flashy blue one at some point. That'd be nice. Don't know what the diamond does. Ah, oh, okay. Come on, that should hoop him a little bit. Oh, I've got a big square one. Whatever that means. He's going to be in big trouble. Come on, you obviously know that I need a red shiny one. That. Oh, well, that, that's what I get for being an arrogant son of a bitch. Oh. We have to have another go. Oh, this is different. They have different skills that I don't understand.
ためにかえれ。No, no, no. Um, okay. So, I wonder if they're all the, if it's all the same game, or if one of the other options is it is it is it all match up the. Um, oh, excuse me, one second. My knees hurt. Um, I wonder if it's like the same gems with different characters. Oh. I suppose we should, do it. we should find out. <laughs> Try Buster Brothers. Oh, we have to choose a city. Oh, okay. I guess if those things touch me, they're gonna... Yeah, they're gonna hurt. Cheesecake's probably not gonna hurt. Well, this isn't very Tetrisy. Um, those little ones. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so um, that was. Uh, Capcom Puzzle World. So let's move to Lumine. Lu Lu let's say Lumine. Feels like it should be pronounced Lumine. Uh, let's get you a screen. It, I mean, it could be Lumines, Lumines, Lumines. Somebody's going to tell me. Okay, let's see. What have we got? We've got a grid, we've got gems. We have to match the gems. Oh, and they fall down very fast. So when we get a square of four, they disappear. Okay. Do they have to be squares? They do. when you've been concentrating with lines all night and then you have to think squares now I'm going to get rid of ah get rid of sixes as well okay Okay. 
wait for that bloody line to go across and I'm missing the, missing the things fall in there. Oop. Shit. What do these mean, do you reckon?
that thing. Yes, no, he cuts there. Brian, Brian, your brain. Jeez. Keep waiting for it to crack into Blue Monday as well. Oh no. Well, it might be chance inducing, but I'm going to run out of space in a minute. Then it's all over by the shouting. Shouting all evening. There we go. I'm dead. I'm dead. There we go. That was uh, Lumine. Lumines. Anyway, let's move on, shall we? Let's move on to uh, a bit curious about this next one. It's called Puzzle Chronicles. Um, and you know when you think, oh, yeah, it feels like we might have played this on one of our puzzle games, maybe, perhaps. But let's uh, let's find out, shall we? Perhaps should have played mini games. Oh. And you know how we feel about story. How's it going? Um, we've played a handful of Tetrises for you late arrivals. We moved on to games that um, don't have Tetris in the title, but are a bit matchy. Um, I haven't played Tetris Effect, but I'm getting the Tetris Effect, which is the name you get. Uh, the name for the, oh, what we've got going on here. Sideways Tetris. Oh, this is too complicated. Out, these are good poofs. Come on, I did something to him then.
So, Elmo, how did your uh, your alarm go? The hobnobbing with the uh, with the rock stars. How did that go? We've been following along on Facebook. Ah, you see, Elmo, those games, those games that you mentioned in the chat, um, I think we've played in our puzzle uh, shows. Um, there's, there's not really much of a difference. It's a, uh, a similarity with no difference, or whatever the phrase is. Um, I'm done playing Sideways Tetris. No, it's not for me. It's not for me. We're... Um, There's too much story. Nobody wants story in the Tetris. So we're gonna do uh, we're gonna do our last one. We might we might poo 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 yo poo yo for uh, for Elmo before we go. But the last one that I've actually um, the last one that I've actually selected to play is one called Puzzle Guzzle. Yes, Columns Columns was played in Puzzles 2, two or three weeks ago. There we go. Puzzle goes all. <sighs> and we should also, I mean, really, we should probably play Dr. Mario 2. But, you know, there are, there are many more shows to go, you'll be glad to know. So... Let's see what Puzzle Guzzle is. Just play Puzzle uh, Puzzle Street Fighter Puzzle Dubri before you arrived. Uh, I, I don't know. Yes. I'm not an Aries, but that's fine for the purposes of this game. Single play, drop puzzle, let's go. Challenge mode, we don't like to be challenged. <laughs> oh, okay, what are we doing now? Oh, it's a, it's like a, a league table, is it? Well, now what are we doing? Right, um, Nutty Cluster, if you thought that last one fried your brain a little bit. This one is, um, worse. I can't, I can't play this. What's going on? I mean, you have to make geometric shapes. But, yeah, there's, there's no way I can win this, I don't think. Feels like we're making Tetris shapes out of the falling shapes.
Uh, I'm on the left. As in, as in all all the games that we've played tonight, I've been the one on the left. Um, so the idea is to spin the tiles so they make geometric patterns. The geometric. Um, no, I don't mean geometric, do I? I mean like squares and shit. Rectangles. Angles. You know, the sorts of things that you'd see in um, in Tetris. Yeah, uh, uh, all right, Naughty Cluster, thanks for that. Uh, okay. I don't, I don't want to do this. I just want to carry on playing. How do I carry on playing? Let's back. Let's do a different mascot and then we'll um Hi, we'll see what up? else we've got. Go. Uh flowery ball or a pink ball. Hi, what's up? Let's go! A flowery ball. go so that was uh that was puzzle guzzle for the um for the playstation uh a portable psp um so while we have a minute or two to take requests we will um, have a look at Puyo Puyo 2. Um, for Elmo. Because that's just the kind of people we have around here. Uh, uh, so, let's have a look. Let's get you a window for Puyo Puyo. I'm sure it's pronounced something different. 
Um, but in Yorkshire, we'd call it Puyo Puyo. So, blue head mermaid, green head bat girl. So it's not going to be brain frying at all. And all in Japanese. Let's just assume we can press buttons and see what happens. Okay. Toyo san Toyo. See, even these guys speak Yorkshire. Yeah, you, you think all the different countries are all different, but even these guys go, eh? Eh? Oh, tits didn't want to do that. I win anyway. It's easy for you to say. Not sure we're doing six stages of Puyo Puyo 2. We'll do this stage and then see how we go. Look how fast he's dropping them. I'm dead. Thank you, Elmo. That fit in quite nicely to our theme for tonight. Uh, and we're ending. That's it. We're ending with Puyo Puyo 2. That's uh, that's the last game for tonight. Um, so, you probably want to know what we're doing next week. I certainly do. So, let's go over to the wheel. There it is, over there, over there, with uh, telling us what we're going to do. 
next week. So, you don't need me to introduce it anymore. We're just going to give it a spin. And we're going to see what happens. Oh, yes. Or, oh, no, depending on where it lands. Oh, oh, what is it? Oh, it was nearly Mod's Choice. Game Shows 2. Oh, not prepared for that one. Um, so in the first one, we did things like uh, Family Fortunes. Who wants to be a millionaire? Somewhere else. I can't remember what. Jeopardy, I think. Um, so, I'll have to see if there's any more game show ones. Uh, now, originally, it was based on real TV game shows. So, uh, it's possible we might broaden broaden ours if we've got fake game shows. Um yeah, I can't think of any off the top of my head. I'm going to have to do some Wikipedia in this week and try and dig some out. But there you go. Game shows next week. So um, so that's it for the Tetris show. Um, thanks to everybody in the chat for joining us live on a Monday night from 7 o'clock. Um, it's always lovely to have you here. If you're watching us on YouTube then uh, you can get hold of us, retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's retro at snugradio.co.uk. Uh, that's also the website, snugradio.co.uk. Um, do you know what? Let's mention it straight at the top. We have a Discord server. It's got every everything that you might want. It's it's all there at the disco, uh, disco? The disco server. That's what we want. Ah, oh, yes. No. Um, phew, tangent. Um, yes, we have a Discord server. Feel free to come along. Pop along. Join in the chat. Um, we've got uh, we've got all sorts going on on there. Um, so there's that. We're also uh, we're also on YouTube, as mentioned, um, as Snug Radio. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe, share. Um, give us a little bell dingle um, and all those things. Um, so we're also on Facebook and Twitter and TikTok at Snug Radio. Uh, in fact, wherever oh, we're always on the net, wherever we are, we are at Snug Radio. So there you go. And uh, if you watch us live on Twitch, you already know we're on Twitch. Um, so, yeah, do all those things. All this comment, like, share. Share with a friend. That's the most important one. Share with somebody else who likes retro games. Get them to come along. Get them to hang out. And, one, you know, one day we might have our own gaming community. We can game together um, and have a community event. So that's it. That's it. I'm done. No more chat from me. Have a great week. Um, we'll be back same time, same place next week. I've been Maff. This has been Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Thank you. And goodbye. Play something retro. 